Hi, and welcome back to my channel. If you're like me and you've been searching for a way to add animated stroke order to your Anki cards, you've finally found it. Before we start, I want to give a shout out to Thorbor on GitHub who created the code we'll be using for this tutorial. Thank you, Thorbor. You've made my life easier. Don't worry if you're not a coder. You'll be copying and pasting, which most of us are pros at. And looking at my screen, you can see Thorbor's code on the left and Anki open on the right. You'll find a link to his code in the description below. If you watch my video where I created a deck using CSV, we're going to be using that same deck. First, let's click on Browse in Anki and select the deck you want to work with from the left menu. I'll be working on the Chinese Learning Deck, and it's already selected. If we look at the cards in the middle pane, you can see that I have two types of cards in this deck. The two types are card one and card two. We'll have to apply the code to one card from each type. Let's select the first card number one, it's already selected, and then we'll click on cards up in the top of the right pane. As you can see, we are on the front template of our card. The front of this card is where my Chinese appears, so this is where I want to place the code. Take note of the name of the field that the Chinese is contained in. Mine is called Chinese, but yours may be called something else, like Hansa, for example. You will need to use the name of this field in a moment. For you beginners, we know that the Chinese field at the top is the one that contains our Chinese because if we look at the preview, the Chinese character is the first thing that's appearing. Now let's click on the window that's open that contains the code and copy it. The code we want is in the third section here. Hopefully the link will bring you right to it, but if it doesn't, make sure that this third one is selected. Then, if you're on a Mac, hit Command A to select the code, or if you're on a Windows computer, you can use Control A. And copy the code, and let's go back to Anki. Here we are back in the front template. Let's click at the bottom and paste the code. Now, if we look at the preview pane, we can see that there is an error in the code. This is because we need to edit the code to reflect the name of the field that we have our Chinese characters in. Remember, mine is called Chinese. Here in the code, you can see the words Hansa field. Let's delete that and type in Chinese. One important note is that the code is case sensitive. So since I have a capital C in the name of my Chinese field, I need to use a capital C in the code. If I don't, it won't work properly. While I was talking, you were probably noticing that you can see my stroke animation displaying in the preview. Let's click save. And now all of the cards labeled card one in our deck have stroke animation. Now, of course, if you only have one card type, you're good to go, but we have two. Let's move on to the cards labeled number two. I will select a card labeled two in the middle pane and then click on cards up in the right pane. So if we look at the front template on this card, we can see that English is appearing. So I don't want my stroke order animation to appear there. Let's click on the back template. Oh. <laughs> and here we can see my Chinese is appearing on the back. So I already have the code copied, but if you need to go ahead and do that, copy the code and then let's paste it in. And there we see that error again. Once again, go up to where you see Hansa Field, delete that, and type in the name of your field that contains Chinese. And remember, it is case sensitive. And now we have our stroke order animation on the cards labeled number two in this deck. Let's click Save. Of course, if you have more than two card types, you will need to do this on all of those as well. 
And that's it for this video. I hope you'll enjoy your stroke order animations and thank you for making me part of your language learning journey. See you next time.